I'm in my classroom today, and we've gotten two identical Monoprice Select Mini Version 2 3D printers, and I found a little odd problem uh, with this one. If you look under here at the extruder, it's a mess. What happened is, uh, as other people have reported online, with these printers, the power supply they give you back here really isn't uh, strong enough to power both the extruder and the heated build plate. And often what happens is when you start the preheat cycle, one will start to rise in temperature, the other will not. And I had started a test print, and what happened is the extruder heated up and it began printing, and the build plate had not heated up properly. And I watched the process, and it seemed to be sticking, but eventually it came loose. I walked out of the room, went to a meeting, came back, and I had this congealed mass of gunk piled up here and piled up on the build plate. It was a disaster. And I got some of the plastic off of here as PLA. And um, the problem that I found is that these printers come with, let's go over to this one, which has not been affected by that problem. It has a rubber boot around the extruder. And what had happened is the, when it became a congealed mass under the extruder, the plastic backed up and filled up this boot and clogged the entire system. In fact, uh, plastic was oozing out of the sides here and oozing out of the top. It was a mess. Um, so, in order to stop that from happening again, I simply cut off the boot on this and then did another test print and it worked fine. The extruder is still a bit of a mess, but the point down here where the filament actually comes out is clear and it worked out fine. I had another problem with this as well. On this one, for some reason when I was doing a test print, you can see the mess here on the build plate. It wouldn't extrude the filament. It just kept scraping across this, and then it went over here, and it began, let's see if I can get a better shot over here. It began burrowing into the build plate. It ripped all the coating off of this thing, which is not a big issue, because I was gonna peel this off anyway and put a glass plate on here. Um, so that was a, a weird occurrence. So just a couple of things to be aware of with the Monoprice Select Mini, if you get it. It's a really inexpensive printer, uh, and it has a heated build plate, so it can do a lot of different filaments. And it's also self-leveling, which is pretty amazing. So good bargain for the price, but there are some cautions that you should exercise when using it. Uh, in fact, I'm going to cut off this other boot right now. Um, all I do is take my little mat knife and just cut right into this right here. And then that thing should pull right off. So there's the boot. Um, and I assume they put it on there for thermal purposes so people don't get accidentally burnt on the element. But at the same time, it is causing problems, so that's what your extruder should look like. If it's in good shape, and then if you had an accident like I did, it looks like this. <laughs>